Welcome. I am Megan Maroney. It is almost Halloween. Let's get to the tech news. Here is a follow-up to the story we reported yesterday about how Google plans to fold the Chrome OS into Android. Mark Bergen over at Recode says that Google is working with partners to build PCs running Android. And in the future, the company will leave it up to the PC makers to decide whether new machines run Android or Chrome. And as we said yesterday, this idea isn't a new one. Even as far back as 2009, Sergey Brin had been suggesting that the two OSs become one. The Android OS for laptops will reportedly be available in 2017. The iPad Pro will go on sale November 11th, according to 9to5Mac's reliable sources. Mark Gurman says the 12.9-inch tablet will be offered online and in stores on November 11th, along with the $100 Apple Pencil and the $170 Smart Keyboard. The iPad Pro will start at $799 for the 32-gigabyte model with Wi-Fi. The highest-end version will be $179. Uh, that has 128 gigabytes and it has Wi-Fi and cellular capabilities. And in other Apple news, Forbes spotted a recent patent by the iPhone maker that allows for retractable bumpers that trigger if you drop your phone. The patent called Active Screen Protection for Electronic Device was filed by a mechanical engineer at Apple. When a sensor detects a drop event, the screen protectors move from the retracted to the extended position to absorb the shock and prevent the screen from hitting the surface. And finally tonight, Tesla's new autopilot feature has saved a life. An Uber driver in Seattle says he was driving his Tesla Model S in autonomous mode when another car pulled out right in front of him and then the car braked itself. The driver claims to have done nothing. The car used its sensors and cameras to determine that it needed to brake.